These charts represent the United States Coast Guard enlisted rank insignia. Ranks are used to describe an enlisted sailor's pay grade. Ranks are not to be confused with ratings, which describe the Coast Guard's enlisted occupations. The rating symbol of crossed anchors depicted in the graphics below are for a bosun's mate. Topic E1 to E3. Junior enlisted personnel are broken up into five definable groups with colored insignia stripes designating with which group they belong. A specialty mark may be worn above the rank insignia, which denotes training in a particular field, either as an apprentice, one that is in search of a rating to join, or as a designated striker, one that has found a rating but is not yet a petty officer. The service person is addressed by his group designation, if known, e.g. Fireman Jones, Airman Apprentice Smith, by the generic appellation seaman", or by her striker designation SNBM Watson, FNMK Johnson. E4 to E6 E4 to E6 are considered to be noncommissioned officers NCOs, and are specifically called petty officers in the Coast Guard. The sleeve insignia is a perched eagle with spread wings also referred to as a Crow, atop a rating mark, a rating mark, or rate, is a symbol denoting the job category, similar to U.S. Army and U.S. Marines MOS, with red chevrons denoting their relative rank below. The Coast Guard does not follow the Navy's practice of awarding gold chevrons for 12 years of good conduct, rather all petty officer rank chevrons and service hash marks are red, whereas gold is reserved for chief petty officers. However, the rank insignia worn on collars have yellow chevrons. On board ships, the first class petty officers become members of the first class mess which serves as a recognition of the status at the top of the junior enlisted ranks. This manifests itself on small ships as a few reserved tables in the galley, but may be a separate seating area or space on board a large ship. The food is the same as that in the galley from which the other junior ranks eat. It also is a precursor to the chief's mess. All ranks from E4 on also have the ability to perform a federal arrest while on duty. Topic E7 to E9. E7 to E9 are still considered NCOs, but are considered a separate community within the Coast Guard, much like the US Navy. They have separate berthing and dining facilities where feasible. They serve as the day-to-day -day leaders and managers of the enlisted workforce, and routinely serve in command cadre positions. Their dress blue insignia consists of a perched eagle with spread wings atop a rating mark, with three gold chevrons and one rocker. Below, inverted five-point stars above the crow denote the rank of senior chief one star or master chief two stars. However, all other uniforms use the fouled anchor device to denote rank. It consists of a fouled anchor with the Coast Guard shield in silver superimposed, with stars above the anchor to indicate higher pay grades, similar to the dress blue insignia. The proper form of address to a chief petty officer is simply, Chief. In the U.S. Coast Guard, the chief is specifically tasked in writing with the duty of training junior officers ensign, lieutenant, J, G, lieutenant, and lieutenant commander. This is one of the major differences between chiefs in the Coast Guard and their counterparts in the Army, Marine Corps, and Air Force. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Command Master Chief. Upon obtaining the rank of Master Chief Petty Officer, the service member may choose to further his career by becoming a Command Master Chief (CMC). These personnel are considered to be the senior most enlisted service member within their command, and are the special assistant to the commanding officer in all matters pertaining to the health, welfare, job satisfaction, morale, utilization, advancement, and training of the command's enlisted personnel. Master Chief Petty Officer of the Coast Guard Reserve Force wears the same rating badge as the Command Master Chief, except that two stars and shield are gold. Topic. Master Chief Petty Officer of the Coast Guard 
The Master Chief Petty Officer of the Coast Guard is the senior enlisted person in the Coast Guard. The MCPOCG serves as the senior enlisted leader of the Coast Guard, and as an advisor to the Commandant of the Coast Guard in matters dealing with enlisted personnel and their families. The MCPOCG is also an advisor to the many boards dealing with enlisted personnel issues, may be called upon to testify on enlisted personnel issues before Congress, and maintains a liaison with enlisted spouse organizations. See also United States Coast Guard Officer Rank Insignia List of United States Coast Guard Ratings <laughs> <laughs>